kind of get an idea maybe how many people could have lived here. Lead archaeologist Joel Brown is helping Licking County sift through ancient artifacts. Each flag represents a location where something has been found beneath the surface, be it pottery or otherwise. Essentially, we're looking at a, a house where somebody lives in an upland area 2,000 years ago um, for a short period. The house was most likely inhabited by Hopewell Indians, well documented in the Great Circle Museum at Newark Earthworks. The fragments found in Pataskala may resemble the ceramic casts of actual artifacts at the museum. The county wants to preserve as much of the Hopewell culture as possible. They were almost ubiquitous in this area at one time and lived here for uh, several centuries. So we weren't surprised. We're just glad we didn't find a mastodon. <laughs> Smith says the county wants to make sure all fragments are recovered before construction begins for a road between Route 40 and Route 16. Commercial development will eventually cover up the land, but in a respectful way. We are sensitive to this site. We're very sensitive to this site and want to do the right thing, and we will. What's found here will allow people who live in Licking County to learn more about how the Hopewell lived, rather than just focusing on the mounds and how they died. In Pataskala, Tanya Hutchins, NBC4.